welcome to another video tutorial in this video i will show you how we can draw different signaling pathways and mechanism for your review paper i know for some student it is very difficult to draw these uh, these molecular pathways although we can draw these all in uh, powerpoint but here today i will tell you a good website that is very handy to use and you can draw your all of these pathway in just few minutes so let's go and uh, you can just write diagrams.net in the google when you will click on this the first link will, will be of this you can simply just uh, open this website and uh, although you can download and uh, work through your desktop but you can also use the online versions so you will simply just click on the start menu yeah here is already i which i used this but now i will show you how we can draw the new and the simple one yeah uh, first we will go to file and then we will go to start with new and here are the different which you can already use their templates we can see that if you want to use any of them and uh, they will allow you to edit the data and the color later on you can choose any one if you like and if you want to use these charts you can also use this one and if you are like doing engineering type you can also use this data for gates and something you can also use this uh, flow charts for your pathways like this one uh, we can simply use on when you will click on this yeah here you can just change your name and later on you can save it as pdf or picture but because now uh, i will show you a different uh, new that we will start with the blank diagram so before that i can also show you some others like here you can do with the networks and uh, softwares and with the help of this you can even draw your house map and many more things and you can do even the vein diagram like let's suppose you want to draw vein diagram with the help of this you can also withdraw and but now uh, for the basic one we will go with the blank one so when you will click on this a blank page will be open so let's suppose we want to uh, draw a one pathway so let that's begin with this gene let's suppose we want to name this gene with this subpellation uh, like serine protease one so uh, you can simply uh, we can see that here it will give you the text option you can uh, increase its size yeah yeah here uh, you can also uh, give different colors uh, whatever you want like any of you uh, whatever you want you can do and when uh, choosing with the color it is up to you what color you want to choose let's suppose for this i can choose this color so uh, now let's suppose i want to design this pathways so we can see that here are four arrows when we will click on the arrows another shape will be added so yeah from here which shape we want to get let's suppose for this we want to shape add this shape so we will see that as we will move the shape the arrow will automatically move and adjust and if you want to remove this arrow just simply click on this and press the delete button so let's suppose uh, here is our uh, step one and let's suppose we want to add more uh, shapes on this side we can simply add by clicking on this and uh, let's suppose by this side we will also want to add another shape uh, like this and we can change its color later on okay and uh, if we want to add more shapes on either sides like uh, this one okay you can also use different color it is up to you whatever you want to use and if you want to add like this one just simply it is up to you what is your plan and what is your idea so let's suppose if you want to add more shapes like here you want to add one plant so uh, you can just go to this search option and you can write like the plant 
when you will click on the plant it will the menu will upload like let's suppose for this you can simply add one plant and uh, let's suppose this mechanism is going on in the plant and uh, next you want to add one arrow so simply you can click right arrow when you will click on the arrow you can see that different types of arrows will appear so you can select one let's suppose you select this one this one and uh, you can uh, click uh, with the arrow and uh, yeah, yeah you can simply move this wherever you want and you can also resize if needed yeah if you want to uh, move you can simply uh, drag this and you can change its shapes wherever you want and let's suppose this mechanism is going in the plant so you can also use this one okay and later on let's suppose you want to add uh, sunlight you can simply write like sun so and you can click on more so wherever you want like this you want to add this color and if you want to go back simply click on ctrl z you can just use why this is attached and let me delete this one and uh, this arrow was added here we can simply click on delete and we can place this arrow here and if you want to change this color you it is up to you you can change and if you want to change the this color you can also change it is up to you like sun is always of yellow so you can add this one and let's suppose you want to add more shapes like the computer you can simply write like computers and uh, let's suppose this is your computer and uh, you have process the information like mobile phone you want to add it is up to you what you want to add and uh, let's suppose you you can add this one so that's all uh, by this way you can design your shapes and uh, your data from here you can also choose your shapes whatever you want like if you want to go to settings you can click on this and if you do not see any option which you are looking for you can simply just write here hope so let's suppose we want to place one book so, so we can see that here the books option are available we can even search more results if needed let's suppose we like this one so we can just simply place here so uh, that's all uh, and if you want to add more text like just simply uh, select the shape and write the number let's suppose this is our gene one and uh, now you can even make it bold italic and you can it is up to you whatever you like uh, you can increase its size it is up to you you can make it bold it is up to you so it is up to you which type of the pathway you want to draw okay so for the time being let me uh, add one more like the shapes like graph if you want to use any graph uh, any any of uh, data like whatever you want you can simply click on this and you can draw like this so it is up to you and uh, you can choose any of these diagram and you can simply and slowly design your um, photographs and diagrams easily with the help of this software so now the last question how we can save this as a figure so you can simply go to file and export you can also export in the form of pdf to get good results and if you want to get uh, png or jpg both are okay so uh, for the time being i am going to save this as the png so it will ask you to zoom 
and border width if you want and you which size you want you want to use as diagram or page so i will select page so uh, you can just simply click on export so you can select the device we can simply click our computer we can see that one diagram will be downloaded so here we can see that uh, here is another mm, the beautiful uh, diagram is downloaded so you can use this for your review papers so hope so this video will be helpful for those who are looking for some websites uh, to design their diagrams okay uh, and let me show you some more other options of this like we can go to new and uh, we can also go to some charts uh, like uh, this one like this data you want to add you can simply click on and the create so let's suppose this one you want to uh, add and this anywhere like uh, you want to change these x axis and y axis you want to change this color you can also use your different diagrams it is up to you and uh, similarly like this you can choose a different vein diagram like this let's suppose you want to choose like this you can simply click you can change you can change the color you can change anywhere and uh, let's suppose uh, we change this one uh, let me write my channel name yeah if you want to save like this so, so you can go again and uh, go to export and you can this time we can save it as jpg and export we can click on device we can see that the figure is downloaded it is very handy very good to use and very easy to handle if you have any further question please let me know thank you for watching bye bye